What's up everybody, back on YouTube for the first time in ages, because I went out shooting with my Instax Mini 90 today. So I went out shooting with my GoPro on a chest mount, so it's kind of like a POV, so you can kind of see how I frame things up, and also see what it's like walking around Detroit taking photos. So like I said, I shot with my Instax Mini 90, I shot two packs of film, so that's 20 photos. I'm going to show you all of the photos, even the ones I don't particularly like too much, just so you can kind of get an idea of what this camera is capable of. There are a bunch of modes on this camera. So you've got a landscape mode, you've got selfie mode, bulb mode up to eight seconds, but it's very, very bright today. Good lighting conditions. I'm in the backyard in the shade, so you might not be able to tell so much, but very good lighting conditions today, almost too bright. So there is a light, a light plus, and a dark setting. So it's so bright today, I was actually using the dark setting for almost every single photo. So something I've noticed on different Instax Mini cameras, I've had, I think, three Instax Minis and then an Instax Wide, and not all of them have the light and dark feature. And on super sunny days, something I've noticed is that if you don't have that dark feature, the whites and any highlights in the photo are going to be blown out, and I don't like that. So I use the dark mode on almost every single photo to kind of bring those down. And it can sometimes be a little murky, almost like grainy, if there are like shadows in the photo or if there's like a lot of shadows but I almost prefer that over having blown out highlights because you can kind of work with the grain a little bit if that makes sense and so I scanned all these photos with a Epson flatbed scanner I've been thinking about doing a video on how I do that so if you're interested in that drop a comment below and let me know but I'm excited to see how you guys like this new format. Um, if you haven't seen any of my old videos, go check those out. Lots of different film stocks and shooting with medium format cameras and things of that nature. Uh, but this one's more of a POV, like I said. You can kind of see exactly what I saw. And it does lend it to being a longer video. So if it's a bit too long, bear with me. I'm, I'm working on the process of making these videos. But let's get out shooting. Let me know what you guys think.
today, unfortunately. Thank <laughs> you. 